Hello, welcome to my next tutorial today on how to create Amazon AWS Brooks IPs. First thing you will need is an account on CreateBrooks.com. If you don't have an account, uh, you can click on uh, login button and fill up registration form. If you already have an account, you can just insert your username and password and click on sign in. To create uh, Amazon AWS uh, proxy IPs, you will need a provider account. To create new provider account, you have to click on My Accounts. And in My Account section, you have to select Amazon AWS. As you see, you will need uh, AWS Access Key ID and AWS Secret Access Key. To obtain this case, you can visit this link. Select ACSK and click on Create New ACSK. Now click on uh, Show ACSK. Copy ACSK ID and insert to <coughs> Amazon AWS uh, ACSK ID. Same for Secret ACSK. Now insert. Uh, uh, your internal name and click on add Amazon AWS account once you are done create proxy redirect us to the page where we can create uh, new proxies uh, first thing uh, you can select uh, profile basically you can create uh, as many Amazon AWS profiles as you need so select uh, one for who you want to create proxies select a data central location I want to I want to select uh, Canada uh, select instance if you need uh, help uh, with the instances you can visit this link and insert how many how many proxy servers you want to create i want to create for uh, this tutorial only two uh, if you need uh, to create uh, more than uh, i think 10 or 15 uh, then you will need to contact uh, uh, amazon aws uh, support right here uh, with request to to uh, to uh, give you uh, uh, option to create more more instances uh, there is no problem to to increase uh, your limit around 200 maybe more so that would be probably needed uh, another option is uh, to select security of your proxies you can select the username and password or uh, you can uh, restrict the access to these proxy IPs uh, by by uh, specified IP addresses, you can select as many IP addresses you want and separate them by space. Um, I'm gonna leave just a default username and password, so anybody who know username and password can access to these uh, two proxy IPs, and you can also select the port. Uh, you can probably insert uh, any number from 500 to 9000 to be okay uh, i'm fine with the uh, default port and now just click on create amazon aws proxies this will take a few minutes uh, you can uh, you can uh, go over to compute ec2 and uh, and uh, find uh, find a uh, find location you select you want to create proxies in i select uh, for this proxies canada So as you see, 
I have already two running uh, instances for a Canada. But still, you have to wait a few minutes before everything will be installed. Uh, instances is just one part of the process because uh, Hyperx you have to install uh, software on these instances. So we can say it's gonna take these two proxies around two to five minutes. So as you can see, uh, Amazon AWS proxies has been installed. So you can start using them. Here is the here is the uh, proxy IP port we select. Uh, username and password. This is always same for all providers and for your account. And uh, that's basically it. If you want to create uh, proxies automatically, then you can visit our API uh, where you can uh, where you can call uh, this to create any number of proxies. Uh, just insert your API key, which can be found in uh, my profile. You can also you can also uh, delete all your proxies if you want to you can delete all proxies from all providers or you can uh, delete just uh, some proxies from uh, one provider so you can keep some proxies live and some proxies uh, you can just manage uh, your proxies uh, by this way you can also get a full uh, proxy list uh, of uh, your, your active proxies. Um, if you want to delete uh, your proxies directly from Proxy, then you have to go to, to my account. And here you can uh, click on delete all proxies. This will basically delete, uh, delete all these uh, running instances. As you see, and uh, that's basically it. So thank you for watching, and see you to our next tutorial. Bye bye.